Hello, welcome to another exciting edition of our Frenzy Connect with me, with Fred Adams. And I've got my brother from another mother, and he's right live all the way from the Lion Mountain, the land of diamond, Freetown Serun. Let's welcome uh, our able brother, Chris Paul Otaibe. How are you doing from my brother? I'm doing well, my brother. God bless you. Nice God introduction. You. I'm proud of you. Yeah. Yeah, I know you're a veteran uh, broadcaster, you're a veteran journalist. You flew in uh, to uh, the land of Diamond, Free. the Free Town. And I know you're there for the first uh, ladies project, a movie, and of course, mm -hmm. so many things uh, coming up for Afrenti Production, of course, Afrenti Connect. Tell us, how's your experience so far in the land of Diamonds? Wow, I must tell you, I'm so excited to be in this country. I came in, I flew in on uh, October 29th, that was Sunday, about three days ago or so. And, um, you know, the experience has been marvelous right from when I touched down. You know, uh, we touched down the uh, sea ferry, sea coach area, you know, where we had to take a ferry down to the mainland. Uh, they called the place Aberdeen and well, we came very late in the night. And, you know, can't believe it, as about 2, 3 a.m., the city was still agog, you know, uh, we were passing the beaches and all of that. I couldn't see because of night, but I was seeing a lot of people. And I was wondering, looking at the time, I hope I'm in the right place, you know, three yeah, years, but they're about, people were still enjoying themselves. The next day, I, I could see the place live and all of that. And uh, where we came to is like, it's a beachfront uh, called Sussex. And it's so nice. The view is wonderful. You can't believe it. You know, this country is truly a land, the land of diamond. And uh, what do you call it? <clears throat> land of lion, lion's mountains. You know, you could feel the atmosphere. And the people are nice. I've been to the market. Um, the Amunti, I'm trying to remember the names, you know. But it was a major market and it was in the night too. Uh, about uh, nine, at about nine ten, it was still there. So, it, like the place is looking, the, the city is looking like a twenty four seven city of a sort, which is quite nice, you know. And uh, it's been nice. And I've been trying to eat their food. I've eaten the cassava leaf soup uh, with rice. I know that they love a lot of rice here. And I've eaten the tapalapa. You know, I come from Nigeria, so <laughs> these names. But I hear that. The bread that we celebrate in Nigeria, in Lagos, where I come from, uh, I can get bread is here in Sierra Leone. So you can see there's a connection, you know, uh, between the two countries and all of that. So, like mm -hmm. you said, I'm here to, I'm here to uh, celebrate Sierra Leone, celebrate all those wonderful things. And I know that uh, they got more, more. I mean, the little I've seen, I, I gives me the idea that there are more to these people and uh, to the country, you know. So I'm really glad to be here. Fantastic, it's good to have you and uh, it's good to have you on the platform. Uh, yeah. I know when you say major Tapalapa, I, it makes me to remember Gambia. That's where we have the Tapalapa is a famous bread in in, in the yeah. Banjo, the Gambia. Yeah. So, so, so it's, it's a cross board. So we're yeah. happy to have you. Uh, can you Thank tell you us so. a bit about why you're here and why you're in Sierra Leone and what's the plan, what project, what brought to you? Uh, can you just it's summarize for us? Because I Thank know you've you done a short video we'll put on yeah. the platform. Thank you very much. So so it, it, it's quite, it's, um, you know, first of all, I must uh, say this. Um, what we're about to do is, is so huge uh, for Sierra Leone. And we, you know, not only for Sierra Leone, but for the rest of Africa. But we are using Sierra Leone as a, a stepping stone, as a platform. Uh, we are here, why we are here as Africa Connect Television is to, the first thing we want to do is the November 18 projects, uh, the UN World Day for, in, commemor in commemoration of uh, prevention of uh, and healing from child sexual exploitation, abuse and violence, uh, which will be hosted here on November 18th in Sierra Leone uh, by the First Lady. And uh, which is significant because the War Day itself, that program was inspired by her own program, the success of uh, Hands of Our Girls campaign, you know, and uh, I think that's a first for even in you by UN standard. 
that a program that a, an African first lady or African government is doing is inspiring a global project as big as that. So that that is what actually attracted us at Africa Connect TV to come here. And uh, we've seen that the first lady, we've, got, we've been on a matter since uh, that award day was uh, created and she was even uh, given uh, an ambassadorship. We've been on our case and we've seen that that lady has done so, so much. And you can see the, the energy in her, you can see her vision, the, 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 the vision fire in her, you know, to not just as all, most other first ladies that we know, not just run a project ceremonially, but she's quite serious on it to, to, to protect and to, to work for uh, victims of sexual abuse whether it be rape, early marriage, um, among all of those things. So I, you know, so we, we have found that she's one we can use as a model for African first ladies. And so that's why we are here to promote her projects, amplify her vision, and magnify uh, the aspiration she, she, she's running for Africa. And of course, you must permit me to say this, um, if we didn't do it, I can assure nobody else would do it. And that is a credit to you, uh, Miss, uh, my brother from another mother, Wilfred uh, Adams. Uh, without your insisting that you do that to promote her, nobody would do it and it would just be there. So we are giving uh, that the African Connective is giving this kind of platform and dedication and devotion to her project, not just for her, but for the rest of Africa is a credit to you and that credit must be duly given to you because you are, uh, you know, because you, uh, without you, nothing like that would have happened. I wouldn't be here, for instance, you know, uh, to do all of this. So uh, away from that, you know, we are here for that, one. And then two, <clears throat> every other thing that is Sierra Leone that, you know, that projects the, the beauty uh, wonders, um, the people, and of course, uh, the beautiful government of Sierra Leone uh, to the world as an example. Like, first of all, to Africa and Africans, and then to the rest of the world. That's why we're here, and we will ensure that that is done. Beyond the media, we have other things that we're doing that we, we have in store for Sierra Leone. Uh, we know that at some point, uh, we will make Sierra Leone physically, physically, uh, as the world's tourism wonder, you know, and uh, so those are the things that I believe that, uh, we, that we have in store for this country. We're here for, apart, besides uh, the November 18th uh, First Lady uh, program coming up, uh, we're also here, you know, for uh, similarly, something connected to the First Lady, a movie, you know, and uh, that by the same title, First Lady. And uh, so that's another reason why we're here. And we know that that movie, too, is about to shake the world of movies. And uh, well, for that, I a shout out to Saw, uh, Mohammed Saw, who is the director. And uh, yesterday I spoke with uh, him and uh, the main character that the world is about to discover, Samuel uh, Conte, who is playing Milton, uh, the detective or the uh, inter agent, as I said, agent and all that. So it's, it's a big time that, you know, that's about to happen, in, in big thing, big deal, about to happen in Syria. That's why we're here. Fantastic, fantastic. I know the movie industry is going to take another dimension because uh, this is going to be first of its kind. Of course, we yeah. know, uh, could be recall that we brought in the Special Movie Awards, mm -hmm. uh, where we, the former uh, Minister of Tourism and Culture was awarded, and of course, the First Lady, and uh, was collaborated with um, the, the, we're talk about the biggest, uh, one of the biggest uh, uh, media houses in Sierra Leone, AYV Television. Of course, mm -hmm. now, uh, credit to them uh, that on uh, DSTV. So that's the level we're taking this. Uh, we looking forward to promote the film industry in Sierra Leone, linking mm. it up, not only within the sub-region. As I speak mm. to you right now, I'm in the 
southern part of Africa, Malawi to be precise. So yeah. the idea is to network, you know, uh, mm. uh, uh, network uh, West Africa, Southern Africa, of course, uh, who knows, maybe, you know, the UK. So let's see how we can have a global village with tons of movie making. And mm. we're happy that you're there and we know that um, you will do justice. Watch out for Chris Paul or Taibe. It's good to have you on Africa Connect. And uh, yeah. we're going to have this daily countdown. And of course, the movie, well, you'll be there for us. So we're going to be counting and talking about it. And yeah. uh, so much for those of you watching and for everybody out there. Watch out for more information. Stay tuned to these platforms. Affinity TV on YouTube and of course on Facebook. My name is Wilfred Adams. And it's good to have you, Paul Otaibwe, live on the program. Thank you. Thank you very much. My pleasure. Thank you. Bye. Yeah. Bye.